Do you need to copy headers or footers from one document to another? In this quick tip, I show you how easy it is to do. There have been lots of times when I've developed two closely related documents. Most of the time, one document is a variant of the other. If I want to copy a header or footer from one of the documents to the other, then there are specific steps I go through. These steps aren't fancy, as they rely on standard editing techniques. Let me show you how quickly you can do this. Notice that I have two documents open on the screen. They're just sort of tiled on top of each other or layered on top of each other here. One of them has a header in it. And if we go to the other, you can see it doesn't have a header in it. To start this process, I want to make sure that I select the document that has the header in it. Then I'm going to go ahead and double click in the header, which opens the header area. Notice that the insertion point is within the header area. Now I'm going to press Control A. This is normally used to select an entire document, but in this case, all it does is to select everything within the header area. At this point, I can press Control C to copy the header to the clipboard. And then I can close the header area by clicking the Close Header and Footer tool right up here. Now that I've got the header in the clipboard, I can switch to the other document and go ahead and double click in the header area on this one. Again, that opens the header area so that I can work within it. Now I'm going to go ahead and press Control A again. You may wonder why I need to do this and the reason is simple. Because I don't know for absolute certain if there is anything already defined for this document's header. By doing the Control A, I end up selecting anything that may already be in the header. Now I'm going to press Control V and anything that may have been selected by pressing Control A is, at this point, replaced with the contents of the clipboard, meaning the header I copied from the other document. You'll notice, however, that this particular header has an additional line in it. That's because we copied the paragraph mark from the other document, pasted it in here, and it left the paragraph mark that was already existing in this particular document. All I have to do at this point is press the backspace key once and I have my completed header in here. At this point, I can close the header and footer areas and I'm back to my regular document. Plus, I've copied my header from one document to the other in just a few steps. If you want to copy other headers or footers, you can do so by following these same steps. Just copy from one document and paste into the other document. The key is to remember to do your copying and pasting in the desired header or footer area of the documents. I hope you enjoyed this quick tip. If you would like to receive a notification of other videos, just click the subscribe button below and then click the bell icon. Thanks for spending a few moments with me today.